able to show them. Hey, what's going on guys? So I thought I was streaming live on YouTube. Last week, uh, the video we did myself with Jamar here in Shaolin American Self-Defense Academy, North Hollywood, to help me prepare for the World Series of Tai Chi push hands, which I am the head judge. Anybody who competes for the $1,000 prize gets to fight against me to win the full amount of money. Um, and what, what that means is that you know, I'm essentially recruiting for a new US team, and I wanna test every player that's gonna potentially be on that team. So only love and good energy about this. We just finished a very intense workout that I thought I was live streaming on YouTube, and uh, apparently it did not happen. So I just wanna go over a quick review with Jamar here, who's in a main, let's look at the athleticism. <laughs> this guy, his body is so hard. He was like checking me uh, on my upper, uh, upper rib cage, and it was just knocking the wind out of me. So this is Tai Chi, make no mistake. Uh, it's just a component of Tai Chi. So I wanna do a, a quick review of what we just did. And so we just did, uh, and, and we'll play an actual round in a second, but uh, what, what we just did, and hopefully we can do it all within one round, making sure this is still recording because of all these challenges, we did fix that because next week the competition is a hybrid of Taiwanese Tai Chi World Cup style push hands fix set. So Gerard was on this side, I was on that side. And we first did uh, single arm push hands each one of us. So let's just go for three points, or for three plays. So he got me on that one. That's no point because he moved off. And I got him on that one. And then we switched legs. That one. <laughs> that one two, it's 1-1. One, one. And that was no point, again, because I moved my legs. Then we did behind the back uh, push hands. And it's not, technically not using your hands. So what we're actually doing, because the playing area is collarbone to hip, but you can still use your head in that playing area. So we're playing here and using between the head and the shoulder as a potential clamp or to as leverage points, and also just feeling out the opponent. This is where he was getting me with that super hard shoulder check. That one. So <laughs> he just got that point. So I got that one. <laughs> nice. Oh, no point. <laughs> so notice. Excuse me. Excuse me, guys. So notice that uh, he used he used and then I responded with a little knee check. So you can do a little checks in the knee. You can't knee the, the opponent in the belly, but you can play some caging. It's called caging with the legs. So we'll go on this side. Nice. 
No point. Very nice. So then we went to actually double handed uh, fixed step sport style push hand. Remember, this is the sport of fixed step push hands, Taiwanese style. So don't get confused and think that this is quote unquote push hands. Push hands is a very broad system with a bunch of exercises. This is a sport component, and it's just one game. Someone calls go, you're already putting pressure on their wrists. They are unconsciously pushing back, trying to get the space. And then you snatch to the side and log your arm, throw your arm like a log, or reach it right through, and it gets to you get that little step. But there's another way to do this. I always recommend body to body, not full body, but body to body, combo to hip boxing to help you train for this game because it teaches you in fight. So, one of the things that we're doing here is doing a variation of the log technique and just banging on each other and t doing our best not to, to step. And of course, we're doing our best as well to take the pressure in and move it into the ground. So we're not just, I mean, we might look like beasts hitting each other, but intentionally we're doing our best to refine the pressure going into our body and pushing it to the ground so we don't step. So, go in here, so we're all right, let's go, about uh, five inch. Okay. <laughs> Let me make sure we got, okay, we are actually recording. The amount of recording challenges in the last week. And of course, everybody, I always recommend mouthpiece. Just, just, just use one. It's so important. I used to carry Three, mouthpiece around. Two, just in case. <laughs> full, body, full body wrestling, head to toe, but push hand style. When you add a boundary, it adds a layer of dynamism. Two points for a throw, one point to push out of the boundary of the red here. Oh, 
So Jamar is a gentleman and a scholar for allowing me, training with me, my final big night of sparring, and for doing the entire set over again, just so we can shoot this video and share it with you guys. Because last week was crazy, and I accidentally deleted the video. It's totally my fault. I believe in Android phones more than iPhone. That's all I have to say. But uh, unless there's a sponsorship. All right, love you guys. <laughs> oh yeah, World Series of Tai Chi push ads, March 26th. $1,000 prize. Go to WSOTJ.com to register and hope to see you there. I'm very much looking forward to sharing with everybody. There's no malice or animosity, negativity at all when it comes to training hard, training with focus, approaching everybody with love, sharing, building a new sport with a new level of uh, raising the bar, a new standard for the athleticism associated with Tai Chi and other martial arts so we can bridge together and share the best of what we all have. So I love you guys, I hope to see you there. And uh, uh, also you can find it on World Series of Martial Arts or World Series of Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. It's all the same organization, love you.